I work with industrial designers and I teach engineers how to work with industrial designers and I teach industrial designers how to work with engineers and I use and we choose to use ProEngineer to do so. Well, it's, uh, it's modifiable and not just parametric, but we, uh, we've de devised a couple techniques where we can uh, make, make significant modifications to a model in, in ways that you can't do in Alias and SolidWorks. With SolidWorks, you've got uh, top-down design, but it's, it's almost like 1997 19, uh, version of what ProEngineer had in 1997. And uh, I could take and quote on a 100-hour project and do it in 20 hours and still charge them 100, you know? And uh, um, with ProEngineer's top-down design and, and uh, all the surfacing tools that we've got inside, um, you know, I'm on the surfacing technical committee too, so I can see what's coming out, and uh, it's uh, it's uh, pretty exciting where it's going. You know, we all, as engineers, have a, 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 a sort of acute attention issue. They don't pay attention to things unless it's engaging, and ProEngineer is so engaging, visually stimulating that you. Uh, are lose yourself in a in the virtual model you know building process and uh, you know pro engineers has given me given me uh, many 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 hundreds and hundreds of I've probably got 30 something thousand hours on pro engineer you know and uh, I've loved every I, people think I'm a workaholic but I just love what I do